Hi, this is Flash from the Daily Drive. Um, I wanted to talk today about our new uh, My Home service. Uh, the reason we started the My Home. Um, the My Home is designed to be a resource for the homeowner, the handyman customer. Um, you know, we um, started finding that handymen weren't going to come to us if they had something to hide. Um, we've uh, done some screenings because uh, like management companies or you know uh, somebody asked us to screen the handyman that they're about to hire and uh, we found um, you know a child predator in, in Hollywood and you know so um, that prompted the thought of um, going to the homeowner instead of the handyman um, uh, to screen the handyman you either already have or the handyman you're about to hire. Um, so I wanted to come up with different services that the customer could benefit from a membership and then we could throw in screening and monitoring your handyman. Um, the screening we check uh, to make sure that they're not on any um, registered offenders lists. We check criminal background. We check and verify um, business uh, documents including insurance um, then we monitor that throughout the year so if we um, if their insurance gets canceled they uh, then we notify you that there you know something's changed in their status so either insurance or if they've you know lawsuit or something pending or something changes then we notify you as their customer and then you can um, you can decide you know how, how you want to handle it but um, so uh, now the My Home Plus would allow you to screen uh, two more, up to two more um, service professionals. And that could be, you know, nanny, babysitter, housekeeper, gardener, you know, anyone else that you would like to uh, screen and, and monitor. Um, you know, insurance, the reason why monitoring is good is because, you know, there are some things that people do. Um, for example, if you ask somebody for insurance and they go get insurance, um, you know, it's very common that someone will get insurance, pay the first premium, and then uh, let it cancel. So they've shown you a, um, an insurance certificate and, um, you know, and they're not paying it. The other thing is that now with the way things are with the computer and and you can go on, and I'm not going to say on here how to do it, but um, uh, you can go on and write your, there are templates that you can fillable forms, you can fill out your own insurance certificate and um, submit that. So we actually verify the information, um, make sure that it's, it's accurate, make sure they have a policy, and then monitor it to make sure that that policy stays in force. Um, you know, as far as child predators and things like that, um, unfortunately, and, and you can verify this by just Googling, um, you know, there have been, you know, it's on the news, it's, you know, there are a lot of things that, one of the ways that, ch you know, sex offenders and child predators get around the system um, is they own their own business. Um, they become a handyman that gets them in your home and um, you know they can't live by a school but there's nothing that says they can't you know they can't work so they become a handyman they you know get into your home and you know they're near your children and you know I mean I can mention things that you know maybe taking pictures of your kids or going through personal items or your kids stuff or whatever or just the fact that they're um, you know around your children and they shouldn't be um, you know, verify this yourself. Go on and Google and do the searches. And I'm, I'm constantly searching um, and keeping you know, up with different, um, you know, uh, different news articles and stuff to, um, you know, just to stay fresh on what's going on. But, um, you know, verify what I'm saying. It's, it's not just me. Um, I uh, had someone message me recently, um, sent me a message about um, you know, death row, um, that, you know, and I have not verified this, but the Texas death row has, you know, the, the most, um, 
I guess the most uh, common trait of a death row in inmate in Texas was a handyman. So um, again, I didn't verify that, but I did get a message asking me to um, go on and check the statistics on the uh, Texas death row website. Um, so our My Home is uh, you know, designed to, to find the handyman, go to the handyman, screen the handyman, um, that you have or you're trying to have or you you know you're looking to hire um, screening the handyman that might not come to us for a screening and that's gonna you know that's gonna open up a door to finding and possibly eliminating eventually that loophole or that way for a child predator or a sex offender to get around the system because if you as the homeowner require your handyman to be certified by the UHA then we can't prevent all crime from happening by handyman. But what we can do is inform you of something that they've done. If they have something in their record, if they have a lawsuit pending, or they have some something bad on you know in their history, we will be able to inform you, therefore, you know, allowing you to make the decision yourself if you want to use them. Um, you know, so that's uh, so that's basically what the daily drive is about um, so uh, you know go sign up let us screen your handyman if it's even if it's a handyman you've had for years I mean if you watch any of these news articles you know the guy there was a guy recently just molested two young girls and everyone was talking about how he was their handyman for years and they never would have thought um, and that's always the case so um, let us screen them. Let us screen them. Let us monitor them. Um, let us get them into our system, and, and that way we can together try to um, try to regulate an industry that that states aren't regulating. So if we can regulate them by UHA certifying them, then it's going to give peace of mind, and it's going to be a lot easier for you know unsuspecting homeowners to hire a handyman and feel safe. So help us out, bring us your handyman. Um, you can find that at uh, the uha.net slash home, uh, <laughs> my home. So the uha.net slash my home. Um, we've, done, we've done about 20 videos now and, and I, I like what we've seen and we've had a lot of views. And um, if, you, um, if you like what you see, please like us, subscribe to us. Um, and uh, and help us uh, help us regulate this industry. This was Flash with the Daily Drive. Happy home repairs.